Tractor City, apparently, according to Darren. Co-op card lock. Sprayers. We all in sprayers. What a machinery here. Paco. Paco is the tall one. The black and white one? Yep. It's not a Palomino. I don't know what he is. There's some other ones over here. There's some of the mirrors. And then there's the black one way at the back. Oh, here we go. Here they come. Hey, girl. Some of you may not know, but uh, Darren's a professional horse whisperer. See how he communicates with the animals? <laughs> Paco is bobbling his head like a bobble head. Okay, so this is the barn where they keep all the horses and when they're not on the field. Yeah. And when it's calving time and they have uh, some calves that aren't going to make it, or they look sickly, or they need some extra attention, we house them in the heated barn with the mums. They need help milking them or something, help them suck. Uh, it's all salary attack. Mm -hmm. There's the hay and the straw. I should say. Hay. Let's go to the wagon to check out the wagons. Here's some more tack. This is the show tack they put on Clydesdales, the big, huge team, uh, Prince and Roy, very big. Yeah, this is the show, more showy tack and salary. When they hook them up to the carriages for show parades and stuff like that. Get them in the chute here. And is this is for what? Uh, inoculations, tagging. For what? Branding cows. Cattle, okay. Bulls, cows, some of the older calves that are getting bigger. And they need uh, inoculations, needles, and antibiotics. Uh, branding, get them to stand still. <laughs> and then we'd, uh, well, we get the thing going here. This is to squeeze them in, as you can see, so you get them to stand stiller. Well, I'm not going to release it now. And, uh, doors used to open this way. Do this. Don't break anything. No, no. And the cows would run out this way, and we'd uh, get them back to the uh, pen. What is it, what's in here? A a what is this called? This? It's called, you know you're a redneck when. <laughs> oh, careful. The chicken flies out. This is the redneck shed. Go inside. Be careful for chickens. Should be fine. Yeah, uh, I don't see any. Yeah, we've got some deer horns up there somewhere. Yeah, right there. Uh, some antlers. Uh, on the left side. Uh, just a whole bunch of other t types of horns. So going back to those horses, some of them are used for just riding in general, and others are used for actual service, like pulling wagons and carriages. Hey, kitty. Has it got a name? No. Name or cat? We will call him Bosco. We will call him Garfield. Oh, look at that. He likes you. It's a girl, I think. Okay, she likes you then. 
That is one. Oh, stupid bee. That is one powerful machinery. A whole bunch of other machines. It's much bigger tractor than my grandpa's. That's a Ford Ally, I think. It's like more of a bulldozer than a tractor. You see, he's got the baler. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Like a giant rotator, and it distributes the hay evenly in the line, so that the cows can get a like a long yield tree. Yeah. Right? Quad, quad. Here's a bobcat. Here's a tractor. Another one? There's a snowmobile. There's a snowmobile. There's a snowmobile. Your uncle has got a lot of machinery. Yeah. There's an old Ford tractor there. Ford tractor. That's better. Ha! <laughs> a little pink one. <laughs> a little yeah. ATV. Here's a little Bobcat. This is what they used to call a doctor's buggy. It's not a, 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 a stagecoach or anything. This is called doctor's buggy. Before they had real huge wagons, you probably have a one horse wagon drawn. Mm -hmm. And you put the top up. And this is what doctors used to do to make house calls in the early, uh, late uh, 1800s. Uh, mid to late 1800s. And there over here we got the show wagons. These are hooking up for the larger teams. And you can see here. Mm -hmm. This one there. That's a one this one there. This is a dune buggy. Or something like a dune buggy. Similar, yeah. Yeah. Cool, we're pretty cool to ride out of that thing. Yeah. yeah. And the old solid goes. Keep going. Keep going. Wild horse? No. Uh, an old tractor. Reminds me of my dog. Hopefully, he grew up a bit. It's very friendly. Oh, oh my god. Wow, buffalo. There we go. That's a lot of them. That big one is a bull standing right there. Oh, yeah, there's a whole bunch of these ones. One Earl! Oh, you vegetarians out there, I hope you don't start throwing up when you see this. Yeah, Darren's uncle is a hunter. Yeah. <laughs> Damn Skippy.